everybody doing today? Welcome back to the Jeep and Daily channel. If you are new to the channel, my name is Kyle, and we are on our way to go buy some food. But if you are a returning subscriber and viewer to the channel, you're probably wondering why we're in the Jeep. And I mean, that's why we're in the Jeep, but it's different being in the Jeep because we're usually not in the Jeep. Uh, my GoPro is usually in my hands, which right now, uh, as you can see, it's not. Um, but yeah, it's a little bit of a different setup today. I figured I'd go out, buy some food, sit down and talk to you guys. We'll drive and talk to you guys for once. So I hope you guys can hear me. Um, it is 80, 85 degrees out right now. So I have to have my windows down because I don't have AC. straight pipe uh, but anyways guys I just wanted to make this video informing you about some life updates with me um, I don't know if you guys can see or not but in the back we do have some wheels new wheels going on for the Jeep uh, they're kind of like a, a fake uh, beadlock looking wheel um, so the ship the wheel should be going on Saturday but in a month or so, me and my girlfriend are getting our, we're moving into a place together, but it's just going to be me and her, and I'm t letting you guys know this because that's why I haven't been uploading a lot recently, I'm not even staying at my dad's house anymore, so I'm not in a, let's, so to say, familiar uh, area, I'm living with my grandparents, but it's just not home to me, it's a house I'm staying in for a little bit till I get my till we get our own place so I am trying to just lay low be a good child while I'm there um, I just come home every day or back I go back to the house every day after work and I just chill out play some video games hang out with them um, so that's part of the reason you guys haven't been seeing a lot of content on the channel like I said I moved out um, I don't really have my full setup anyways. The light is green, the light is still green, it is about time. Uh, so, like, yeah, I'm, um, I'm not with my familiar setup. I don't have my laptop really set up. It's probably dead right now anyways. But I just did upload a video on the Sunday or Monday. Uh, going from going to Cars to Coffee at Lehigh Valley with the OG Zilla and the Guitar Mageddon ZL1. But the only reason I even uploaded that video is because I actually had content for the video or for YouTube, which I haven't had content or anything to do the past month besides fixing this and going off road. Which, by the way, Sometime in the new, near future, the Jeep is getting some new modifications done to it. Uh, it's stuff that I've had, like we're doing the wheels and the leaf springs will be going on. And I will be cutting the fenders so these 33s don't rub. Eventually adding some new fender flares. Um, what else? And I might be getting a new set of 33 inch tires. Haven't decided yet because these are still basically brand new. They probably have 10,000 miles on them. But, into a life update for myself, like I said, I'm not living at home, I'm getting my own place with my girlfriend, so what does that mean? That means I will be in my own area where I don't feel, so to say, weird or... To, I won't be shy to make these videos. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Which, I shouldn't be weird at making videos at my own home anyways, but that's just how I am. I just feel shy and weird about it when I'm at my dad's house or at the shop or something. So when I'm in my own place with my girlfriend, I will be better with sitting down and creating content or going out and doing stuff. 
stuff, which by the way, I know I talked about it three, four, five months ago about this summer being the best summer for this channel, whatever. So about that, as you can tell, I barely uploaded all summer and that's because the Jeep broke. I decided I was moving out, so I didn't want to spend money on a new car. I've just been keeping my money safe and sound in my bank account where it should always be anyways. And on top of not having a new, a different car, I didn't go off-road at all. What? I think I went off-road once, maybe, and that wasn't even really off-road. That was just texting the, uh, the transfer case. But because I didn't get to go off-road all summer, plus it's been piss miserable hot all summer long. As you know, a lot of Jeeps probably of this era doesn't have EC. I actually just spent $100 to fix it, but this transmission throws off so much heat anyways, it probably wasn't worth it, so I just suffered. But the OG Zilla, if you did not know, he got a right-hand drive straight from Japan, turbo diesel Toyota Land Cruiser, and me and Mikey, Mike, we're friends. After he gets it wrapped, we're going to be doing, hopefully, lots and lots of off-road trips. So, if you guys have not seen his vehicle, his uh, Land Cruiser, I suggest going to his YouTube channel, at the OGZilla, or his Instagram is also at the OGZilla, and checking that thing out, because it is awesome. It has, the center console is a mini fridge. You can put, and it, and it makes ice. You can put water bottles in there, water, whatever make ice cold, keep the drinks cold, if you got food, keep the food cold. So that thing's pretty dope, but he's getting it expelled, like a clear brawl, so he doesn't scratch the paint because it did get repainted a few days before he picked it up. But the thing is absolutely mint, it's beautiful. It's not even my car, I'm in love with it. I was so excited for him to get it, and now I'm even more excited to go off-road with him. And Basically show them what the good old 95 open diff piece of shit Cherokee is capable of. Show up his Land Cruiser maybe. Hopefully knock some trees out of the way for him. summertime and hot warm weather better than cold better than the winter but this is piss miserable I'm ready for these 70 degree days again because working in this stuff in a warehouse is also unbelievably miserable it's always like I'd have to say 20 30 degrees hotter in there there's no AC there's a few fans throughout the warehouse that are on the ground, which I'm usually up in the air at the roof, at the roof, or at the ceiling anyways, where it's even hotter, 50 degrees hotter up there. So it feels like at least, and the humidity does not help at all. One thing I wanted to mention before I ended this video, but now I can't even remember. Well, I guess I'll just wait. So, after the following modifications are done to the Jeep, um, whether Mikey's vehicle is ready or not, we will definitely go off-road at Centralia because my dad should still have his Wrangler. He's been looking to get rid of it, but I, he should still have his Wrangler by then. And I know he is down to go off-road whenever, wherever, as long as it's Saturday and Sunday when we both have off work. So we'll probably head up to Centralia and beat the shit out of the Jeeps. See if they break or not. But that's probably not going to happen for another month or so anyways. I wanted to thank you guys for your support to the channel. I am almost at 300 subscribers. And obviously that's the most the channel's ever been at. Uh, and I think for having 300 subs uh, that I get a good amount of average views on the channel of my videos which i'm beyond grateful for guys i said my goal was to be at a thousand by the end of 2018 we're almost 
700 away from that. We're not, probably not going to get there by the end of the year, which it's okay. The first 1,000 is hard to come by no matter what, but there will be a lot more videos hopefully going up over the winter time once the Jeep's running better and everything's done to it. And I'll hopefully be taking a lot more off-road trips and also getting the new place to help out a lot also because I will be in a comfortable area for myself to make and edit videos. So guys, thank you for watching this. If you are new to the channel, hit the subscribe button down below. If you enjoyed this update video, leave a like. And as always, comment down below what you guys would like to see on the channel. Besides off-road stuff, because we're going to do that no matter what. You don't need to tell me. So besides off-road, if you want to see anything on the channel, let me know down in the comment section below. <coughs> and if you have any questions for me, drop them down below also. I'll be more than glad to answer them. I will always try, no matter what, to answer every comment or at least leave a like on it so you know I read it. Um, but yeah, guys, that's going to do it for this video. But before we end it, I'm going to say bye. But we are going to get a couple more 